Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Let's Play. Today we're taking a look at Warhammer, the Horus Heresy, Age of Darkness, uh, the second edition now of the Horus Heresy series from Games Workshop. Um, I'm joined today by Jay and Chris from Lords of War Games and Hobbies, uh, two of my biggest sort of like co-conspirators when it comes to Horus Heresy stuff and huge fans of the series from the first time around. You've seen them play tons of games against me uh, and they basically um, painted up thousand point armies that are reflective of the stuff that comes in this box set because this is the, the rules for what's in this box is what we have so far for Horus Heresy and they're so excited about the game that they've basically taken the, the current range of Horus Heresy miniatures and made armies that we can play against my Raven Guards. So we're going to take a look at the um, the rules for the game run through a thousand point game uh, and basically have a throwdown, a showdown uh, between the forces that come in the box and of course some classic miniatures from the Horse Heresy range that we have the rules for in here. Uh, now if you want to see the review of the contents of the box and the rulebook you can go up here in the cards and check it out uh, and we're just going to dive in and start playing a game. So let's take a look at the, uh, the forces and get this underway. So here I am set up for my first game of Warhammer the Horus Heresy, 2nd edition. Um, and divide up the starter set into a thousand point army, I decided to pull out this stuff to play with, to start off with. So I have a Praetor, it's a single detachment, a Praetor with a um, power sword, and he's got just the, the usual gear that he comes with. So a stock Praetor with sword has a power sword, Mastercrafted Volkite, Volkite Charger. A bolt pistol, close call weapon, artificer armor, iron halo, frag grenades, and crack grenades. Um, I didn't buy the paragraph made because I couldn't get the points. As two troop choices, I have a 20 man Legion tactical squad, all with chain bayonets because they're so cool. And then a, um, a power weapon, sorry, not power weapon, a power uh, lightning claw on the sergeant with a plasma pistol and an NCO Vox and a banner. My other tactical squad with a stock sergeant, power sword, plasma pistol, um, and then an NCO Vox and a banner as well, all with regular bayonets just because they look cool. Heavy support, we have a Spartan Assault Tank. It's the Dust Clad with its Laz Cannon Arrays and upgrades. And then I have a um, Contempt of Dreadnought with uh, a uh, Gravis Melta Cannon, uh, a Power Claw, or not Power Claw, a, um, a Havoc Launcher, and a Plasma Blaster, or just a Twin Bolter, sorry. So I had all my Terminators and my other Praetor. This is 1,000 points, one detachment of Raven Guard. And here's Jay and Chris's uh, example of an allied detachment of Chaos Legionnaires. Well, I guess they are Traitor Legionnaires. So, uh, led by Kallion, the uh, Decurion of the Iron Warriors. We have an Iron Warriors detachment. Uh, so it's two troops. We have a Mark III Marine troop here with a Power Fist and Plasma Pistol. All with chain bayonets. Jay converted chain bayonets out of the, the little chain swords these guys come with, which look great. And with a banner. Uh, we have the Decurion himself. Converted a Fafnir Ran with his sweet double axes. He's gonna have a Paragon Blade, uh, rules wise. There's the second Chain Bayonet, uh, Power Fist, and um, Banner unit for the Iron Warriors. And then finally, a unit of Terminators. Uh, there's a Sergeant with a Power Sword. Uh, two dudes with chain fists, a lightning claw, and a, um, what is it, a heavy flamer with a power fist. And then an allied attachment, just to show how the allied rules work, and the fact that you could make this out of the box as well. Um, we have your, uh, is his name Dagar? Dagar, the, uh, the champion of the Death Guard here. He smells terrible, and so these are actually distrusted allies, which means that they don't count as scoring. Even though they are line troops and have the ability to score and deny, uh, these guys only deny with their pungent odor. The Iron Warriors don't trust them. And it's a tactical squad with a Power Fist Sergeant and then a um, Paragon and Axe a Praetor with Paragon Blade as the HK. Right, so we're going to rock on a battle in the Age of Darkness. So we have our armies. We're going to set up the game, uh, do our deployment, first turn, game length, victory conditions, and mission special rules. Now instead of rolling, we're just going to do Blood Feud as our first uh, game. The battlefield size is 6x4. It's a classic terrain uh, placement. We've got a cool STC like colony planet here um, with some like rocky outcrops and some industrial sites all placed down. No special rules apart from the fact that they're blocking and provide cover. Um, and there is a scatter method for placing it, but I went with the it looks cool method, which for Horus Heresy feels like the right way to do it. Then we determine our deployment map. So I'm gonna have or uh, Chris, who's on this side. I'm gonna interchange their names this whole time so you guys don't know which is which. We're the same person. So roll, they have the same person at this point, yeah. I'm gonna have one of the lords roll a six uh, for our um, deployment type. It's gonna be Vanguard Strike, which means we're doing sort of like, uh, it's a table corner to corner, basically. And we'll have a side A and side B deployment zone. From the middle line, going from this corner all the way over to 
that card. For Blood Feud, Blood will have blood, sorrow piles upon sorrow, and vengeance breeds vengeance, which is an ancient Terran proverb. Um, also, revenge is a, a dish best served cold, which is an ancient Klingon proverb. So, setting up the game, before models are deployed, deployment maps must be determined, which we've done. Uh, and then deployment, to determine the deployment order, the players roll off. The winner can choose to deploy first or second. Uh, the players deploying de uh, second deploys their entire force, including any fortifications, after the first player deploys half. Um, and then each player should determine their blood feud target, which we roll under the victory condition. We actually get to decide. First turn, the player deploys first also has the first turn, unless they seize the initiative. Game lasts for six turns. And then primary objectives. Uh, the mission's victory conditions are achieved by destruction of the enemy's fighting strength with a particular strategic target in mind, whose loss will cripple their foe. At the end of the game, the player who has scored the most victory points has won the game. If the players have the same number of victory points, then it's a draw. So, Blood Feud, after setting up and deploying armies, but before the play begins, each player must secretly note down a particular Blood Feud from the list below. At the end of the game, the player's chosen Blood Feud is revealed, and they get additional victory points. So, Blood Feud, kill infantry for plus one, kill demons for plus one, dreadnoughts and automata are worth two per unit, cavalry and flyers, two um, for each unit, non-flyer vehicles, plus two, and a primark is worth plus six. So basically, you're going to look at your opponent and go, what kind of units do they mostly have? And they'll be worth a bonus one for the Blood Feud. Um, and then secondary, slay the Warlord. If a side destroy the enemy Warlord, they get an extra victory point. If that Warlord's also a Primarch, then additional victory points is uh, still scored if you took that Blood Feud. Uh, and then last man standing, the side with the greatest number of surviving units gets plus one victory point, and the price of failure if the Lords of War units are used. Then our special rules, reserves, and night fight. Let's roll off for deployments, and I got a five. You get a five, we'll try it again. I got a two, you got a four. All right, so you win, so you can choose to um, deploy first or second. And you deploy half, I deploy whole, and then you deploy half again. We're deployed, so my Praetor, who is an ever-vigilant warlord, meaning he gets an additional movement phase reaction, um, and adds his initiative to run moves, which is crazy, actually his initiative plus one, is gonna be inside my Spartan, over here. Then we have my Contemptor and a unit of tactical marines on top of the roof of this hab. We have a big giant line of Iron Warriors uh, with the Praetor hanging out with the Cataphracti, uh, the two squads on this flank, and then the Death Guard sent on their own secret mission to uh, smell things up on this side. All right, uh, so now we're going to see so who goes first. Floyd first, I will have first turn, unless Jane and Chris can seize the initiative on six. Don't do it. Yeah. Oh, Legionnaires, don't do it. All right, so we're into the first turn. So turn summary. The start of the active player's turn. Resolve any rule happening now. I don't have any rule that affects that. The movement phase. Uh, my active player gets to move my units that are capable of doing so. And now, it, unlike... I'm so excited to use a red whippy stick for this. Unlike old editions, um, where everything moves six inches, now everything has a fixed movement value. So this guy moves 12, and he's going to do so. He's going to roll on up with his crew full of murder marines. I dread he's gonna do the same. He walks eight, actually. Climb over this, I just lose two inches of movement to go th over the difficult terrain, and I move six instead. These fools, I think they're gonna leave. So I get to move down three and then across four with this unit. So we measure the distance that we're gonna move, and then these guys are gonna head down and continue the advance as well. Oh, did we want a night fight? Did anybody here want a night fight? I feel like I wanted a night fight. If we decide to night fight, then I get to roll a die on a two plus. The first turn's at night. It would help you hide from my Spartan. It would. It is, all right, so it's a night fight. So yeah. minus one bliss skill on a four plus, it'll go away on turn two, otherwise, and the sun will come up, otherwise it's gonna stay. It gives the value of my searchlight a bit of improvement. <laughs> I had one, which I didn't pay for. So I'm playing a thousand points. So um, with that done, if anyone's inside 24, I'll be able to shoot. I don't think anyone is. In 24, I'm not shooting this turn, so it is over to the Iron Warriors turn one. Uh, the shooting phase is over. Actually, I could have run if I wanted to, you wanna do that? with this unit right here. Four inches of extra movement to these guys if I wanna run, they won't shoot in the shooting phase anyway, but it means everybody can get off this building if I want. I move forward slightly. He'd run too, but I'm pretty happy with where he is right now. Uh, and so I think it's shooting phase. Again, everyone's still at a range. Assault phase, no one's in um, uh, range to roll 2d6, to be within 12. And then the active player's turn ends, and it becomes the, um, player two's turn. So we go over to the allies over here, and they get their short turn stuff. There's nothing. Now you're stoic defenders for your warlord, which means you get two reactions during my shooting phase. So move in seven. Now the cataphract, you only move six, and you could advance as well if you wanted to, if you didn't want to shoot this turn, and uh, add your initiative to go 11 inches. Let's so you can go 11 it. instead. Let's Take cover. So you don't come within 12 of me, there's no reactions to do here, so and it's nighttime. So you're probably not shooting very far anyway. Also advancing, going 11, making run, run moves. We're gonna hoof it. 
hide behind this building. Slow dudes were fast. That's it. Yeah. Well, this is before the this is before the the rot really caught in. Yeah. Now the uh, characters, and this is something for people that play regular 40k, they probably don't realize the characters are actually joined the units, meaning that they are part of the unit, and damage can't be allocated to them outside of it. In fact, you only move six, and they cannot make run moves because they are the heavy special rule. Oh, heavy. So they are um, bulky too, heavy, which means that they get to uh, reroll saves against um, blast weapons and template weapons, which is kind of cool. Nested rules in this game that you kind of have to, to suss out, but once you realize what like line, heavy, and light mean, you start to realize that the infantry types aren't all exactly the same. So obviously all the tactical marines are line, which means they're scoring and denying. Doesn't do a lot in this mission because we're just trying to kill each other, but big in objective missions. But the heavy troop has actual like ramifications as far as um, just even what you get saves against. With my Havoc launcher, for instance, they're gonna get to reroll their saves of two plus. Not running the second squads, they can take some pot shots into my tactical squad over here. So within 24, but half of them, throwing down some bolters. Okay. Yeah. So we'll skill three plus. Uh, sorry, we'll skill four, yes. which means you need a three plus. <laughs> oh my god, that's gonna take some getting used to again. Back to charts. Back to charts. Um, so yeah, with a, uh, it's funny. Uh, your chance out of six of hitting with bliss is gonna. It's not uh, done for you. One die because I moved. Uh, rapid fire guy. You're not rapid firing. That's right because you are not relentless. And that's three hits. And now the strength versus toughness. I uh, your bolt is strength four. My toughness is four. You know, four, five, or six to wound here. Two, two. One modern conceit. They do describe the 40k ninth version of doing two wound rolls, and then just show you on the chart. Except that they show you where it drops off, and you can't do it at all. Too. That was how many wounds? Uh, two. Two saves. Okay, so two three plus armor saves. Your AP five, which means I just get my full armor save. There is no save mods in this game. And it bounces off, ping ping. Now I'm gonna spend my reaction in the shooting phase to shoot you back. Oh. Four Marines shooting back with their bolters. Force because of our bolts skills, right? I forgot about that too. Uh, not that it mattered because I didn't fail any saves, but return fire. Um, buh, 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 buh. That's it. Just shoot back fire from being stationary at long range. It's just rapid fire. And I hit you twice because I only hit on fours. And then once again, strength four, toughness four. I don't want it all. Right. So I use my token, and that's it. Salt phase, no one is in range to charge, so we're into the end of the active player's turn, and it's on to round two. Dose. All right, so once again, into the movement phase. Well, we don't want to run, we want a gun. So that means sitting still with some people. All right, let's get into guns at clock range. So we're walking into the, the storm of fire from the Death Guard. I'm walking seven. Getting ready to shoot the guns. And eight with my Dredderick Tatum. Right here. Oh, on a four plus, does the night fighting end? It does not. So we're still minus one to hit. Automatically next turn when the sun comes up. Uh, and then you're just gonna get a little closer, not to Terminator Town, we don't want that, but getting getting closer to shoot some guns. All right, uh, now it's time to shoot the guns. So movement phase over, shooting, I'm going to, I think, start with you. Because you're not going to return fire me, are you? No, you wouldn't do that. Uh, and we're going to do, just to show off the rule, we're going to do our Havoc launcher and our all of our guns into the Terminator squad. The Dreadnought rule, he can move and fire all of his weapons, counts as relentless, so he can move and fire without having to snap fire. And we'll start with the blast weapon. With the Gravis, mark exclamation point. Gravis Melta Cannon is heavy to Armor Bane Melta, twin linked, and uh, it's two shots at 36. So I know I'm in 24, uh, I'm going to take two shots at minus one. Now normally that guy, I think, hits on twos. Skill five, so he would hit on twos, goes to threes, because I'm the last one to hit. Oh, but it's twin link, so I can reroll all my misses. Look at that, healthy reroll. And then it is strength eight against your toughness of four for the Terminator squad. So because it's double, it's a two plus. Two. Now your Terminators do have sweet, sweet four plus and vulnerable saves that they can take. I'm AP one, so I ignore your regular armor save. So four ups. Yeah. Oh, passes and passes, laughs. Laughs at my Gravis Melted Cannon. And Bolter. Ah! Ah, that doesn't work. Havoc Launcher is 48 inch range, strength 5, AP 5, heavy 1, blast 3 inch, and twin linked. So now because we're using a blast weapon, put this over the thickest, fattest part of your Terminator squad for me. That looks thick and fat right there. I like it. So a full and looks like five, five partials. Yep. And I get to. Uh, <laughs> there we go. One, one is the freighter. So now, if I if I land it with a hit, right, it goes on there. Otherwise, it scatters. Two d six minus. Dice, Ash, oh sure, just because I <laughs> just I brought my own from home. <laughs> <laughs> this is the one Jay brought from home. All right, so where does it go? Uh, uh, it's gonna scatter. Up. Ah, it lands on top. Oh. All right, sweet. So strength five against your toughness of four, Freighters. full, and then the four guys are partial hits. 
So four Terminators, one of whom is hit, and then the Praetor. Actually, it doesn't matter because yeah, you assigned the wounds. Assign you you assigned the hit. Yeah. So it's only two sit, two rolls to wound at strength five. So it's one better, it's a three plus. One wound. Only AP five though, so you have a two plus save, and because you're heavy, you can re roll it if you fail. I'm good. Nah, you're good. <laughs> That's just like it exploded around you. They didn't even like stumble, it didn't even slow no. them down. If it's all feel better, I'm gonna fire eight last cannons in that tactical <laughs> squad. <laughs> because the terminator's basically just washed out my dreadnought. I'm going to see if uh, these guys survive eight last cannons. Uh. So it's not twin linked, it's actually two last cannon arrays. I can fire front, um, and they're four shots each. They're heavy four. So a last cannon array. Strength 9, AP 2, heavy 4, 48 inch range. Now my uh, my uh, tank is blitz skill 4, so only hitting on 4 plus though. So 4 plus to hit. Light. Because uh, of the night time, yeah. So 4 hits, not bad, okay. the odds. Strength 9, yeah. your top is 4 iron warriors. Yep. Let's see if, you buffed your, <laughs> let's see if you buffed your armor so that it reflects back what? on 2s. Oh! Ah! Oh. Only two. And you're out of cover, which means no extra save. Oh, my no. defensive weapons yeah. could shoot uh, into uh, the closest thing they can see, which is, I think, just going to be the same squad. So that's my heavy bolt. He uses reaction to evade, which gives him a shrouded five plus. So you get to make uh, two five plus saves to try and get these guys to stay. Basically, you duck for cover. Kiss the dirt. And neither one. So they both eat the last cannons, and I've oh. caused two guys. Actually, you do this... Uh, you'll, you'll get this also against my heavy bolter because I think it's after all the shooting is resolved. So the twin linked heavy bolter is going to be four and twin linked. So that's going to be one hit and then we don't have three plus as well. One more save. AP four. Uh, I re rolling, right? Is it twin linked? Oh, that's right. I do, I do re roll them. This twin linked. Uh, so one and one. remains three unchanged. Plus. Three yeah. plus, you're good. So. Mm -hmm. Two, two Iron Warriors died of the spark. Which is Boulder Town. Uh, it looks like all but these two. I th Actually, maybe these guys can even see. I think he can still see. Yeah. So it's going to be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine shots of boulders. And you've used your token to evade. So no shooting back now. Do you have two? Uh, no, you can shoot back now with Strike Defenders. Oh, Warlord Trade. Because your Warlord Trade gives you an extra one and your Warlord's on the table. I actually can't use my Warlord Trade right now because my Defenders, my guy's in the, the tank. You're evading and shooting. That's, That's right. So nice. hitting on fours and then, oh geez, Strength 4 times 4. First wound. That'll be five saves. Whoa. That's it. Bolt to town. Managed uh, to kill one. Oh, okay. So we got the, enough for a morale check. And shoot back shoot, too. Shoot back as well, yeah. Yeah, might as well Strike Defend. Six. Yeah, that guy's kind of. I don't yeah. think he's. No, Sarge is hiding. Sarge is like, I don't have a gun that shoots that far. Right. Everyone defend me. Yeah, right. Leadership <laughs> is being alive. So, four is to hit. That's right. <laughs> Lead from the rear. Uh, and then, four is to wound again. So, three saves Ooh. for my Raven Guard. I yeah. fell two. No! Oh, Sweet vengeance for you. Guard. Uh, I'll take these two. You can't react to a react. That's right. There's no react inception. We're not going to go to a different layer of reaction now, unfortunately, because it's not the opponent's shooting phase. So I can't react react. Uh, so I'll check. So 26. Uh, Legion, I think, so is leadership eight, maybe nine eight for the with, Sarge. Eight with the Sarge. Eight yeah. with the Sarge. Seven goes to eight. That's right, because they're just human. Good. Laugh. Charges. So that's going to end the turn. You passed your morale check, so it's on to turn two. Traitors. Turn. Everybody regains their. I regain my full um, points for the round, and then you get to do your movement phase. For the Warlord and his men, moving forward. And remember, we've secretly determined what you're trying to kill for extra points. Start advancing into the stockade, making a run move so they can clear the wall. It's a very fleet Death Guard here. <laughs> and then advancing with more Bolter Bros, who all have chain bayonets. They have Shred for rerolling rolls to wound. All right, so the Survivor's uh, advancing here, just making a regular move along with the other Tactical Squad. And the Terminator's going long, can't run, but they're going to try and make a, a flanking maneuver on the, uh, the squad. Guns o'clock, who are you going to shoot at? The Death Guard all ran, because they're they're speedy. Yeah, yeah, so we'll try and get some double shots with some of these guys. I guess. You got it, yeah. Anyone within 12 gets to shoot twice. Uh, so it looks like hmm, four. Four plus a pistol now, too. Uh, four plasma pistol, and then one, two, three, plasma. four more regular. Oh, like I can definitely five see five more, yeah. Well, going in. Fours, because it's still nighttime. Holy moly, still on fours, yep. Because the sun will come up tomorrow. Tomorrow. Oh, for the Primark, you got five? Mm, yep. Yeah. All right, let's see if we're iron within, iron without. Uh, so we have three plus armor saves, because you're only AP five to our three plus yeah. armor. Oh my god, okay, well I guess I'll spell my reaction for Shroud. Shroud <laughs> <laughs> it's because it's because we're all replacements. We don't know how to actually use our armor. Ah, oh, so I save one, so two more guys die. Plasma him. Ah, 
Wow! Right in the beak! This was very different from previous editions. It gains rending 4 plus, as opposed to being AP2. It's only AP4. Hits on a 4? No, nothing. AP2 and it rends. And then the other squad, also ready to get down to business. And I've used my token for shrouded, so I can't use it again. Oh, and... Looks like four, so five of them. Four to wound. Two. 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 Okay, guys, come on. I know this power is new. You don't know how it works, but put the batteries in. There we go. Double sixes. Still <laughs> hits on a four. No. no, but doesn't blow up at least. Blows up all the time now. <laughs> um, so shot, shot. Terminators can kind of see, but can't really hurt what they can see. So it looks like we're done the shooting phase. I gotta make a morale check. Leadership eight for these poor fools. No, they oh. fall back. 2d6 inches away, so morale, I'm gonna fall like 8 inches. Towards the closest table edge, that's mine, by the shortest route possible. Everybody falls back and goes, no thank you, there's a lot more guys over there, Korax, than you said there was gonna be. So I rally, I'm only allowed to make fallback moves. End of round, we move shoot assaulted, we're in round 3. And it's top up, third player's turn. Well, I'll start with these guys and see if they regroup. Come on, fellas. Nine. Yeah. No! They fall back again. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> They're destroyed! They go 12! <laughs> These are like the, literally like new recruits. They're teenagers that were put in this armor. They're not even scouts. They're like, get off our lawn! Do you know how many wars I've seen? I'm like, yeah, I like, uh, saw them go to ground and return fire, that's and that right. was too much for them. He's out! <laughs> Rerolls, that kind of stuff. Uh, so that's my movement phase. I need to get some more guys on the table here. This is becoming a problem. So we're gonna do exactly that. So 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 here, here comes here comes the ruckus. We're gonna uh, disembark. So everyone gets placed within two inches of an access point. Now, luckily, my access points are enormous on this thing because it is a, it is a, it is designed to do this. Pile out. Everyone's placed within two inches of an access point, which in this case is the sides and the front, uh, while still running a coherency. And then we all walk seven and go like, "Hey, nerds." You brought guys? We also brought guys. Choice here to either pistol you or rapid fire at you, but you can react right now in the movement phase. I'm within 12. Now what I would do if I were you uh, is react with uh, somebody somebody heavy. The, initiative, the point actually to move the Terminators towards me, and they get a, because they're heavy, they're minus one initiative, so they move three inches instead of, yep, absolutely. Yeah. And you ignore terrain when you do it. Imagine they're walking, they just crush their way through it because they're Terminators. <laughs> And that's your one token for the movement phase is a reaction. You're gonna advance with them, yep. uh, and then I get to keep moving. So this fool's gonna be like, hey, hey, Death Guard, hey, hey, uh, hey. I'm mean, just gonna pivot <laughs> and back up slightly. <laughs> be like, hello. Oh. <laughs> Have you heard of my friend Last Cannon Ray? <laughs> so the movement's done. Let's shoot some guns. I'm gonna start with my Gravis Melta Cannon into these here bros. So into this big squad of, uh, of uh, Death Guard. So on. Twos, because the sun's up now. Rerolling because I'm twin linked. And then strength eight against seven is four. Uh, only one at AP one. But you get a cover save because you're in a building. And it's a four plus cover save because it's a fortification. No, she was oh. one guy. Drop the hammer of the blast weapon. So it looks like this spot right here is pretty good. Over that guy's head. Should hit uh, a couple fulls and a partial. Uh, oh. Sideways minus five though. Right, because I'm ballistic yes, skill five. Yes, 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 so it's gonna land right there. It's gonna hit three fulls, and I think these two are partials. It's on fours. So five total, and it's strength five. Strength five against toughness four, three to wound. Yeah. That's gonna be three saves at three plus. Now we got one. It's just my bolter, which is in rapid fire range, twin length. Uh, hits once, but I get to reroll. Hits twice, and then wounds on fours. One more save, just regular save, Don't AP five. Up. Alright, Andretti's done. Let's go to the big squad o bolters. Uh, we're gonna pick on the smaller squad. So I'm pretty sure everybody's in rapid fire range. So that's gonna be 19 guys with bolters. We're, gonna, we're not gonna do the the charge move. We're just gonna shoot you. I think. We could do 19 pistol shots. Let's do 19 pistol shots in charge. I like that better. So 10 shots. We'll just reroll these. So hitting on threes with bolt pistols. Uh, that looks like two, four, six, seven, and then one less die. Minus these two, so seven plus seven is four. I, gotta, I still have to roll a wound, so that's okay. 10, 12, two more dice. Thanks, sir. Uh, on four, strength four times four, the bolt. I managed to land total eight saves of three plus. I'm only AP five with that bolt pistol. So unleashing the pistols as we get ready to charge. Full you could. But well, you do it after you make saves. You, you, you don't have to spend it yet. Yeah. 
<laughs> and, and that's why you oh, don't. Give me that sweet plasma pistol. It hits. And then on a four plus, it'll rend. So it's yep. a three to wound. Four will be an AP2. Nope, just a regular, regular save. save. Ooh, it didn't get the AP2. Interesting. This feels different. Ooh. You're fine. What great is if you, yeah, if you, if you take wounds, you take more wounds. So I hit on twos, because I'm Blisco 5, or six. And then I wound on threes. Make two Ooh. saves at AP5. Am I Volcan Yep. And then you take one more hit automatically, so make one more save. I'm oh, sorry, I have to roll a wound though. And I do, and then make one more save. You're good. One row dies from the uh, volley of shots. Volley of shots. All right, uh, so you could return fire or shroud. You have two of these dice. Uh, return fire. Return fire. Do it. Uh, two, three. I think he's in here. Oh, everybody's in, yeah. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. So ten oh, shots fire. of bolters. Please. And I can't return fire the return fire because there's no there's no reaction no inception here. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> On fours, looks four. like four saves. Are you guys as bad as the other ones were, who ran away? Uh, you lose one. Plasma pistol. And the plasma pistol. Yeah. Oh. Oh, Overheats. Oh no. Uh, AP hit equal to the attack, and you pass your save. So you just shake off the burning plasma Ooh. leaking down your hand. It's time to make myself feel better with uh, eight last cannon shots into the squad. <laughs> Once again, <laughs> the Spartan will make me feel better because the Raven Guard are sad and <laughs> maudlin and not doing very well. So let's go four. So hitting on threes into this Terminator squad. I uh, hit with five, and then the strength nine, toughness four. So winning on twos. That's five AP two, so you get your four plus invulnerable save because it's better than your cover save. Or equal make to. them all. Oh, <laughs> I hate you so much. I hate you so much. <laughs> You're iron without and iron within. Um, all right, well let's uh, let's do the heavy B then. So I can defensively split it over into this squad. Which I think I'll do. It has a better chance of hitting. Hitting on threes. Rerolling because it's twin linked. And then wounding on threes, strength five against toughness four. Two saves, three plus. Loses one. In here, or the smallest one? The closest one, so it has to be that one, yeah. Okay. It's all my guns! Uh, so they could return fire at the tank, I guess, if you want to, but that doesn't seem like it's gonna Jesus. be worthwhile. Yeah. Kill two over here, so that might be a morale check. Get him! Ah! Oh no, you also run away. So you run away 2d6. And run nine. Oh, they fell back. It wasn't actually the murdering that scared you. It was just there's so many guys there all of a sudden. Uh, which way do I go? Towards your table, uh, fastest route, closest uh, closest route towards your table. Edge. Look, and they'll try and rally at the start of their movement phase. You see space marines running away. Like that's that's a very horror heresy thing because the space marines are way more human. All right, so I'm gonna declare a charge against this squad and roll to see if I make it. So. Yeah, you do. I got an 11, which means these guys get in. So the closest model moves in first to complete the charge, and then everybody else can move 11 to try and wrap around. So I'm just gonna go blob-wise. Blob. And get everybody into base contact if I can. I said you're gonna hold the line and try and make my charge disordered. So you get to make a morale check, and if you pass, I count as disordered for my charge. I lose my plus one. You do. So basically, you guys steal your spines, and I don't get my charge bonus of plus one attack. Same thing over here. Oh. Going into this squad with the dread. Blade man is way through that stockade wall. Didn't matter for this charge move or the previous one, because I'm movement five to seven. I get plus one to my charge roll because I'm movement eight on the dreadnought. His long legs give him a bonus to his charge Ooh. distance. Your terminators, uh, if they were a little bit slower, would get minus one. So if your movement rate is one to four, you're minus one. If your movement rate is five to seven, you're plus minus zero. Eight to 10 is plus one, 11 to 12 is plus two, and 13 plus is plus three to the charge roll. So charging in, I fail. So I'm plus one, but I'm also minus two for the wall. So he just goes, ah. Charge move, if the charging unit's charge is considered to have failed, it must move every model in the charging unit towards the target uh, of its failed charge, number of inches equal to half the charge distance rolled. So I move two inches towards you. Hey! Okay. Charges, so we go over to here. Now I am going to issue a challenge and be like, hey, Power Fist, wanna go? I accept. I accept. And he goes, ah, uh, sure. Your hat's a lot bigger than mine, but let's do this. <laughs> He's literally taller than that guy is. My uh, my Praetor is not messing around with the sword. To fight until we're dead, but we go in initiative order, and I'm gonna make an example out of you. Uh -huh. Power sword, I'm weapon skill six against your weapon skill four. So that means I hit on threes. I have four attacks, but you did disorder my charge. That's right. Now I do have a uh, additional close combat weapon, so I get to take an extra attack. So we have um, an AP3 strength weapon uh, with a rending on a six plus. So I'll be able to get AP2, but you only have a three plus save. So hitting on weapon skill six against weapon skill four, so I think that's a three. Five. Hit on threes. 
Uh, it's going to okay. be one, okay. two, three hits. Okay. Oh, and then uh, I've got a strength of four. So I went on fours. Okay. Threes and twos. Oh, Just oh. one. But it's AB3. It's enough. It's enough. No. I no. slice off his head before he can power fist me. Models to one side because that counts our combat res. This is like Warhammer. Warhammer. Um, and now we go to the initiative four step, and I'll let you do yours first because you have less guys. This will be less dice. So I'll find them. Eat. Pile in. One dice each. Weapons go four against weapons go four. They can't direct attacks into the Praetor. So hitting on fours. He's in a challenge right threes. now. Yeah, threes re rolling because you're plus one strength. And shred lets you re roll the wound roll. And the AP, Chain I believe, is band. five. Chain yeah. bands are where it's at. That's so five easy. saves. On a three plus. Do you guys know how to use your armor? Are you new marines or old marines? You're mostly old marines, so I lose one. So now I get to fight back, but he'll get to fight because he's not actually dead in this issue step yet. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. Yeah, he'll be fine. Dude, you'll be good. Uh, so also hitting on fours. And that's gonna be seven with the first roll, take it a die. Seven plus. Could you imagine the chainsaw noises happening right now? <laughs> it would be insane. Five. Chainsaws trying to cut through metal would be the loudest thing in history. So it's 12 hits. So three's rolling because we also all have chain bayonets. <laughs> chain bayonets are where it's at. Uh, and I needed them apparently because uh, I have weak arms. You know I got weak arms. Uh, that's 12. Uh, Just 12 saves. Let's see how good your Mark III plate is here with my, my new fashion. Nice <laughs> I'd really like to shroud in the nice melee face. phase. Oh, sorry, oh, here, here, here. Oh, okay. yeah, 12 okay. total, right? Yeah, 12 total. On three. Space Marine. AP Do your legendary saves. Let's go. Do it. Make all your saves. Kill, kill, oh, <laughs> kill no, yourself. He did. Oh. Yeah, he did. <laughs> So apparently, apparently my <laughs> my karmic realignment oh, against Jay is not complete. <laughs> I, got a, I got a lightning claw. I got a lightning claw. We fine. Two attacks. It's a yeah. specialty weapon though. I think it's unwieldy. Need a uh, extra close combat attack for it. Oh, so it's on fours. Yeah. And then wounds on fours. We have to re-roll because it's shred yeah. wounds. And it's also rending, AP so it's AB two. AB two. I think it's rending. Yeah. yeah. Either, either way, you it's AB three kills. Well, I made an example out of the sergeant, but then everybody else let me down because they're all just teenagers. So I won by one because I have one in my combat res plus a banner for two you have uh sorry i have two to my combat res plus a banner for three you have one to your combat res plus a banner for two yep. so you lose by one so your sergeant's dead so your morale is at minus one that's the amount you lost so by i'm uh actually six sixes yes. yeah leadership six pretty low don't do low. it oh. no i go face off and add our initiatives you're a four i'm a five because the praetor is ready, ready to kill I seven roll. guys by himself dead Oh, yeah. Ah, I gotcha. Oh, so those guys are wiped out. So we get to make an end of combat pile and move, which means we can get back in coherency with that. So these guys are just going to move their three inches back together. And then everybody gets to make a consolidate, which is a initiative value move using the lowest initiative in any direction. So I'm going to use a four inch initiative move to get the hell away from these terminators. And <laughs> we're just going to fall back and be like, well, we scared you a lot and beat you up, kind of, but we also don't want to get charged by the, the, the murder guys. Right, so it's bottom of three, over to the traitors. Rallying some fleeing troops on an eight, because they have their dude left, so they can turn around and act normally. It's time to move. These guys walking up there six, although the, the Praetor can go seven. He's allowed to move further. Yeah, I must, uh... He also leave if he wants. He can go show me the paragon of his blade. How? Paragon. Check out the paragon of my blade. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Go seven. Go seven. Just basically. Everybody, get me there. You've been doing a good job so far of the get me there because you've made every invulnerable save you've had to make, right. which is which is right. great. Yes. These guys got our saves. We're gonna make a kill box here. Around. Oh, it's coming! It's Paragon time. These kill guys box. are like. So they don't move are, though, do they? Uh, no, they, they no, rally. They I think they can shoot. consolidate when they rally, and that's it. Oh. Spend a movement phase. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> withdraw. Yeah. Yeah. And I get to move his initiative plus one, so I actually get to move six inches when I withdraw, mm -hmm. which is legit. So I get to move to this line back here, basically. He's just going to be like, no thanks, live to fight another oh, day. Back away for so long. Korax, <laughs> we've done our job, we killed a squad. You can come to us later. And we'll react to these guys moving. And that's because of my Warlord trait, uh, which is a, the evasive one, where I get to... Basically move my guy's extra distance. It's over. Um, I could relocate him too, actually, if I wanted to, in advance. Because I have two points in this phase because of his world right, trait. Right, right. It's only his initiative. You could move forward. But I can move forward towards you. Yeah. Yeah. So I guess what I'm going to do, I'm going to go... Yeah, we'll just move in. Because I, I can't use the point otherwise and just get some to move around. You're shooting phase. Who's going first? 
Do? Going in with the uh, Iron Warriors who just rallied first. Ten, they did watch their friends get turned into a large red and golden yellow s smear. Are they going to rapid fire? Are they going to? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They can definitely rapid fire. Yeah. Far, so. so, not shooting pistols, going so with guns. Uh, that's a nine. Yeah. yeah 2d6 roll of nine with no bonuses because you only have oh, eight. Stuff. Eight yeah. would get me. Eight. Mm, hey, you're close enough. Yeah. So let's see if I can kill a few dudes. Yep. Do it. Sure. On threes. And then on fours. Ooh, nicely done. Five saves. We do my armor does nothing. This is fancy new Corvus armor. Now nah, I lose two. I will <laughs> spend my points on shrouded. Okay. Five up. Lose one. Four shots rapid fire from your terminators. They all hit into the same squad. And three, three saves. Ooh. Twin Link Bolters. I pass them. Pistol o'clock. Oh, did you roll your possum pistol in the squad? I did not. So I didn't see that. Yeah. Quick here. Um, Missed. Uh, possum pistol's not doing well. And then the Death Guard. Pistol. Taking some shots. Oh, here you go. That's That's nice. Nicely done. And then fours. Two. two. Two saves on a three plus. Passed. That is. Uh, it's a full kite char. Yeah, full kite pistol or whatever. Shots. Two shots, definitely great. Twos, they hit. Yeah, on plus skill five. Threes. Two saves. saves. Three plus. Fail, I, get more. I do fail once. You get an extra one, so roll the wound again. Definitely great. Nope. Doesn't win. There's another Marine. All right, well, that's. Uh, and then your bolters. Yeah, that's right, so you can charge. charge. Yeah. Got it. Yes. Okay, yes. well, that looks like I'll shoot back at them then. That's yeah. right, yeah, yeah, just running. So I can't use my token. It's you that gets two of those tokens. All right, yeah. charge phase. Yes. Uh, we do just one? Well, it's nine this way. If we want to try there, okay. you could. Oh, it's more or you can go into the you can go into the tank. It's a ten, actually. All right, you can get a laser cannon over there. Or Someone's or getting over. Is it snapshots like ten, six? No. Or? Oh, no. No. It's yeah, to go. no, it's supposed to go. <laughs> it's only one. It's only one oh, thing can do it, right? You get, it's yeah. it's limited to the yeah, number yeah, of tokens because yeah. the tokens are basically replacing <laughs> CPs in this yeah. game. Yeah. Yeah. But I can definitely Overwatch with eight las cannons. So it's mm. ten either way. Uh, <laughs> Oh, I think I only do it with defensive weapons, though. Last cans, it's just All right, enemies. Terminators, let's roll a 10. That's right. Push right. this button and explode it. All right. Woo. Go for it. Woo. Nine. Oh, oh, so, close. so close. Extra measure measuring. Ten's like, remeasuring. Remeasuring. <laughs> remeasure again. Extra remeasuring. Uh, going over there, yep. Yep, I'm going to get minus two because I'm jumping. And who are they going into? Oh, uh, they're going to try and charge. Got it. Go for it. Yeah. Yeah, All uh, day, every day. I'm still going eight. Yep. Yeah. No, it's your turn to get through. And now I overwatch. It's going to be these six that can't see, it looks like. Everybody else can see past this line. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten bolters. So 20 shots. I'm a Volkite Charger. So that's going to be six, ten. Hitting on threes. <laughs> one into the guns. Uh, all hits except for one. And then no another ten. So nine so far. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Nine plus five is 14. Fours. <laughs> Uh, we're moving on for it, sorry. Uh, only five saves. Into that Death Guard squad. Yeah! Oh, I got three! Holy uh, moly. Shroud. And you can't shroud it during <laughs> my charge phase. And then the Volkite Charger. Try to sneak it in. Hits once, and then... Wounds, one more save. Holy, holy moly. That's good. You good. Make morale checks as part of a reaction. Say so I get to move your ten inches, or eight because you're going through the wall. And the fight occurs. No, no pressure, Chris. Um, Crater no, has the best no pressure. Ashes Crater in a single combat. Probably so, well, here's the question. Would you like to issue a charge? Yeah. Or issue a challenge? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. All right. I accept. I have a Paragon yes. Blade. I have a Paragon Blade. I'm a Paragon of Blading. My blade is bigger than you, though. <laughs> I'm going to ask you a question. Yeah. And I'm all cape. Yeah, I'm all cape. I'm all cape. I'm like a... I'm like a, I'm like a, I'm like a right. I'm, like, I'm like a fluffy cat, right? I'm just a rat inside all that. That's right. That's correct. So I'm like an alpaca. So you uh, you get to... Well, we're in issue of the same. Yeah. So uh, I'll let you roll your dice first because you're active player. Okay. Yeah, you're special, so no no um, extra attacks. You do get your charge bonus though, because yep. you yes. charged. Mm -hmm. So you get five attacks, both weapon skills six, hitting on fours. Big numbers, no whammy. Ooh, Ooh nicely done. Is it Master Craft or just Paragon Blade? No, it's just, it's Paragon, just Blade. Paragon Blade. Got it. And then so it's uh, threes to wound because it's strength five. Threes to wound. Oh, so looks like three, three and no murderous strikes. You didn't yeah, get yeah, no murderous strike. Oh, yeah. Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. So the AP is two. Two. So AP two means I get my iron four plus iron halo save. That's right. Yeah. Iron halo. Pass two. Take a wound. Ah, oh, he's blooded me. Who's left? And I get to strike you back with just a plain old power sword. It's just extra big. Three attacks, extra weapon, because I can pair this one. Hitting on fours. 
ooh, I'm tired from all the other killing I was doing. I just love killing, Morty. And then forced wound, nothing. Stand and die. All right, so that was initiative five step. Initiative four step, you want to go first with your boulder bros? Yeah, sure. So I think I got, this is where uh, the, just four uh, guys. the chain bayonet lacking might, might is going be, to become apparent. Might hurt a little bit, yeah. yeah. So fours? Oh, plus one for a turn, right? Yeah, so four more. Third. I made a difference. Dude, yeah. Five. And forced wound. Two. Regular armor saves. Make them both. Ooh. Also get to pile in. This is gonna be an owie, I think. And now it's everybody in coherency so of, of people. Combat. No, yes, you know. So far, but uh, right. I don't know if everyone's gonna be able to fight here. Mm, you're gonna pile around, you're gonna pile around, because I think the back guys are gonna be out. So I think these three guys. Is aren't it the it's, or it's incoherency of someone who's in contact. Okay. A two-inch rule. So I think these yeah, so five three. probably aren't yeah. in the second row. Mm -hmm. So it's everybody else. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven guys with bolt. Oh, Eleven on fours. <laughs> yeah. The chain man. That's maybe a different problem. Yeah. Uh, so I hit you five times, okay. and then it's okay. threes to wound re-rolling because okay. of the shred. Yeah, that's pretty good. We're gonna get noisy. Decent rule. Uh, and that's five saves. Yeah, you oh. just kind of auto wound with the chain man. Yeah. <laughs> How many times did I hit you? Well, that's how many saves you're making. Oh, oh no! It's it's shrouded! Is that the sergeant too? Oh, it's not the sergeant. One, two, three, four, just exactly oh. the sergeant. So, luckily the, he will but fight. But the lightning claw gets to go! Fist, fist, fist. Alright, so, uh, lightning claw is still initiative oh, four. No, lightning claw. Hit on oh. fours. Oh. No! You're lucky! Oh, you're lucky, so you get to do your power fist now. Alright, sergeant's two attacks? Two attacks, and, and I think it's specialty though, but you charge. Charging, so yeah. three. Alright, you need all, all, all of these to them. connect. Yeah. Yeah. Right, connect with everything. <laughs> Two, oh. and then strength eight, so twos to wounds. Crush, crush. Crush, crush. So you kill two, and no saves against that. Okay. And that okay. puts my combat res at, I killed four. Yes, you killed four. Five for a banner. Yes. And then you got a wound in melee, and then crush two I'll for three. Two. So you lose by two. So oh. whatever your Praetor's leadership is, minus Ten two. minus two. Ten minus two, so eight. Don't beef oh, this. Boy. Don't beef it. Don't beef it. Oh, yeah, we're good. The landing. They lost all their friends, but everything else is fine. So now we need to consolidate base initiative order if you're not in contact, so the producer's just going to push in. <laughs> I just feel a little nerve wracking, doesn't it? It's getting sporty over here. Yeah. So we've uh, completed the melee. Morale checks are done. It's on a turn four, top of. Well, I don't want anything to do with these Terminators. So I'm going to pivot and then back up eight or nine and then pivot again. And my move within 12 and, of you. Yeah. So they could fall back and withdraw. I think everybody outside of 12 doesn't get to do anything. He's gonna have to go inside the stockade for his movements <laughs> and then charge out of it, because otherwise he, he can't end within one inch of you. He's gonna walk into there, just Kool-Aid man his way through, like, oh yeah! All right, so um, movement's over, because I'm in combat here. Let's do some shooting. Those guys, yeah, they could get in the war. Could get one to move up or back or sideways. <laughs> <laughs> it actually is up or back. It's either away or towards. Yeah. Act? Okay, that's fair. Um, so let's shoot some guns. Uh, I'm gonna start over here, and I'm gonna put my last cannon race into the indestructible Terminator squad <laughs> that apparently will not die, hitting on threes. The sun will come up, two more. It's like I only hit half the time. Yes. Two thirds of the time, I hit half the time. <laughs> and then we on twos. Yeah, I got oh. those fours. Uh -oh, no. Make all your Not saves again. again. Do it. Make all your saves yeah, for a third time. Twice. I can't do it again, can I? Oh, Almost. Almost. <laughs> all right. I will shroud. <laughs> oh my god, okay. <laughs> Five so, that, uh, so it's instant death, so you lose. You have to make two shrugs here. Because oh. you all your, your, your wounds are reduced to zero. Oh, but I can make one here. Yes? Yeah, as long as you make one, somebody's still alive. Yes. Yeah, sure. the power, sorry, power sorry. How many last words? Just take no. to kill a terminator. <laughs> Apparently, all of them. <laughs> uh, and then I'm going to shoot my heavy boulders and win on threes. And that's going to be three saves. Three, three two pluses. pluses, yeah. And actually, get your shot against this too. Not that it matters to me. Right, let's do the blast weapon. Pulls in uh, four partials here. It's going to go back five, though. Mm. So back five, like to there, it looks like. Yeah, nothing. And then it's my uh, Gravis multi cannon. Multi cannon? Uh, which twin linked, and then mm. wounds on two, strength eight. Ugh. I melt two. That's a track right there. And then just and just the bolter, <laughs> which rapid fires, hits twice. Wounds once. You're safe. Morale check. Oh. Can you do it? Nine. No. Oh no! <laughs> wait, well, wait. Your praetor's. Do you have an incio box? Yes. An incio box actually lets me reroll the blast. Nah, that would be funny. But I'm in combat, so I don't think I can do it. Oh. Like anyway, yeah. Uh, and so you go nine. And say peace out. 
Sort Keep of. it rolling. <laughs> Keep it rolling. <laughs> Keep it rolling. Active Iron Warriors. Right. Guns Clock uh, is over, so we're into the charge phase. I don't really have any charge. Oh, let's go charge. You charge into the fist again. Yeah, right? I'm going to charge into the unit here with the power fist and the Praetor. I can't fight six, the Praetor, seven, but I got a six. Yep. So I Kool Aid Man through and go, oh yeah! Oh. Just no reaction. So that looks like combat time. It's starting with initiative five on the Praetors. Somebody yours first. Mm -hmm. Sure. Seven. Only four attacks this time. Oh, here comes that instant death, though. Let's just Cut his head off. Three, two. That's, that's all we need. Just one. one three to wound. Five blocks. Yes. Get that instant death. Oh. Yeah. Oh, oh no! I'm going to pick both my vulnerables. Oh, don't do it. Don't do it for boss. Live! Oh, <laughs> Just chopped his head off with the parallel blade. Any wounds go to there. Uh, uh, and you've slain me in a challenge. Uh, Dreddy is initiative. Four. So he's going to go at the same time as all of my marines. Yeah. Ironically, I can't fight anyone except for this guy. Yes. So I can make an example to him, but I lose, I tie combat I think no matter what I do here because of my banner. As long as I kill the Sarge. The Dreadnought crushes his face, so he's survive, got but, uh, four attacks. Is it contempt? Uh, five, uh, so three attacks. I'm gonna be hitting on threes though because I'm, I'm uh, better weapon skills, so two hits. And he has a Dreadnought Power Fist, which is not actually um, uh, unwieldy or no. slow, because it's not a Dreadnought. Two's. Oh. One, Ooh, only one. Strength, lots of good, 14. Crushed. He gets crushed. Two wounds in your challenge. I got one wound um, plus my banner. So we tie and nobody makes a round. A warlord, which means I lose my I lose my two reactions. Yeah. Saw it in the combat and be like, hey, uh, what's up, nerd? <laughs> Rally your marines. Yeah. Seven, oh, they do. Wow, you guys are great. Do they get these guys are just, these iron warriors are like, I I feel like this no, is a better place for us to be. They can consolidate, yeah. It's consolidating to be like coherency and yeah. stuff, yeah. Oh, it's, is it? Is it's your initiative move, I think, yeah. right? Yeah. Terminator's coming in. Oh, Get ready to, to do the power fisting. Oh, despite appearances, I'm pretty sure you guys have this. Because I have one squad of marines left, <laughs> and. Stuff be closing in. <laughs> yeah. Like never underestimate Jay's ability to have the dice let him down. Command point. It still seems like it's yeah. Never, everyone's missing command points right now. Why can I control what these dice do? They just do whatever they want. Uh, yeah, everything's in melee, so you don't want to shoot me. And with them, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I mean, he could leave during the movement phase. Nah. Just try to finish these guys off. Get him in there, dude. What do you want to do? Well, if he's here. Yeah. Then I can make two charge rolls. I don't know. Oh, that's what you're thinking. Yeah, you could do that. Just, it's more insurance. Yeah. Why not? Yeah, sure. Just put him like I'm not doing the movement phase, for sure, yeah. So, who's charging first? Uh, we'll do him. Okay, go. Go for it. So, his is longer, yeah. Yeah, it's like a six. Oh, yeah, all day. Seven. And these guys. Oh, Nine? Nine? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You get it. I think we're going to hold the line. And we pass our test, so yeah, we're gonna so no plus one attack. I'd like to issue the challenge. I'm, I'm, I mean, you're already in base contact with me. You get to, one person can issue a challenge in the combat. So if you challenge it, yeah, he'll, he'll turn down, then he doesn't get to fight. So that's yeah, that's good. If nothing else, my my lightning claw doesn't go off. Oh, yeah, so you can sure. do that. challenge. <laughs> no, no, thank you. No, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so could you uh, could you just stand over here, and I'm gonna just stand in the way. Hey, Steve, go 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 talk to this guy. Both prayers get to go first. We see they're gonna have a contest of how many legionaries they can kill. <laughs> yeah, this is this is uh, this is. Gimli and Legolas right now and getting their getting their kill counter on. Extra one or whatever. You do you get a bonus one. Yeah, you get your bonus <laughs> for like You go first. Month. You attack the Marines. I want to see if I want to fight the Dreadnought. Oh, okay. Getting right. spicy. Do it. Threes. Uh, threes to hit. Yep. And then strength five with the Paragon Blade. So threes to wound. Murder two. strike a guy. Uh, murder strike one. Well, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't matter. Two guys just get exploded. Third guy with Paragon Blade. Paragon <laughs> axe. Okay. I'll need to pop some wounds on there. Yeah, we're just gonna yeah. put so it go for it because it's six is different. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So. he's tough to seven. Oh, All right, so into the unit threes. That'll do. Oh. Two, uh, not twos, threes again. Threes again. Yeah. Midra strike. Oh! oh. That's three. That's three, that's three instant deaths. Uh, like, it doesn't matter anyway. Uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right, well, you, you won the kill contest so far. <laughs> yeah. And then it's initiative four phase. Yeah, so These guys will go right here. And sword guy. And yeah. sword, yeah. And sword guy, I'll let you go ahead. Yeah. But I'll get to fight with those models. Yeah. So far, yeah. I'm losing yeah. by five. <laughs> you get three attacks with the sword guy for charging. That's mm, right. Disorder charge. So. Oh, disorder, that's yeah. right, because I held the ones. You get two. But you will get three with him because he has paired weapons. They're the same. Okay. Um, Miss. Don't scrub us go five. Nope. Nope. Okay. So then the lightning claw on fours. One. And then rerolling to wound. Fours. Got it. Just kills one. AP3. Uh, yeah, he does. 
Um, so, actually I won't take him, I'll take somebody who would lose his rock. Let's take you. Uh, so then I get to fight back, and that's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Uh, regular strikes, we're going to do them all into the ca- oh, actually I have to split these up. I just realized. I'll do, so he, so I can put these four into him, and then the other four into him. First four dice, hitting on fours, actually fives, because you're up to skill six. One, winning off three. So one regular two plus save for that guy with his artificer armor. See, laughs. Four into the other Praetor. Actually, there's, sorry, there's five there. And the other Praetor, because the sergeant's not fighting. Hit on five, oh, so I three see. hits. That's an incredible rule change. And then rule threes thing. to wound. It makes characters so much safer. Yes, Shred to reroll. So one. two, two saves. This is into... Into your Praetor, yeah. Did we get them at all? We're good. Oh my god, nope. Uh, and then my last initiative four thing, which is kind of important over here because he's yeah. fighting two chain fists, yeah. is to stab some of these cataphracti. Five at least, they hit us on fives, which is nice. Uh, oh no, yeah, it's yeah. fives, yeah. That's right, I got three attacks. Contemptor, baby. Hit on threes. Oh, oh. And then wounding on twos. One, four balls and multiple save. Can he do it? Nope. Ah, he eats oh, one. So five. the wounded guy dies, Sarge dies. Yes. And then it's uh, Terminators who haven't fought a clock. So the power fist gets to pile in. You probably, yeah. And then everybody else is trying to truck model on the dreadnought. Oh, yeah. Can. I, could, yeah. I don't know how far he's allowed to move, but. Just three inch pound. Okay. Anywhere you want. And then to put the three guys into. He already fought. He already fought. He's a pile in, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So I'll go. Oh, yeah. We can go do this. You have to keep coins here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. Six stacks. Oh, so the chain fists are separate. Is it? Chain fists are separate. roll to wound? Uh, no. I might do something. Actually, hang on. Right, so you get uh, armor band against dreadnoughts and automatas. Reroll all your field rules to yeah, So you seven. hit me on fives. So I'm not disorder against this guy, am I? It's not. Uh, because he didn't hold the line. That's right. Oh, no, no, your charge becomes disorder. Yes. So, oh, yeah, so yes, everybody yes, becomes yeah, disorder. Yeah, yeah. 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 Think of it as like we chuck yeah, grenades yeah, yeah, yeah. at you or yes. whatever it is. Okay. Uh, the regular power fist? Yep. Five. Fives. Missed. Nope. <gasps> oh, come on. Save me weapons, go five. Save me weapons, go five. Oh! Yeah, it does. Oh, so hard to get you. Oh. Oh. Okay, yeah. okay, okay. Well, the bad news is I killed one guy. <laughs> <laughs> I caused one wound. You caused six. Uh, so it's six to two because I have a banner, mm -hmm. um, and that means I'm gonna lose by four. So their leadership of eight goes down to four, but the dread's fearless, so he's sticking around no matter what. Yeah. Oh, no, oh, so close. Two. All right, yeah. uh, I think you can pursue. Pursue at plus five. Plus I'm one. at I'm at plus. Oh, sorry, yeah, uh, you got your initiative. So basically, yeah. you're at plus one. I'm at plus zero. Oh, 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 oh I God. can't roll a seven. <laughs> so <laughs> <laughs> they're dead. <laughs> I like how these guys just came in and like made hammer. made marine sauce. <laughs> It's like feeling very alone right now. Am I gonna go? I so now get he he get... can consolidate, uh, or the and these guys stay. Stuff? These guys just consolidate oh. and stay in the combat. Yeah. Yeah. you can move your initiative with this guy in any direction. Okay. So you can just move away if you want. Yeah, you but I don't really, really want to get octo. Does he have melt bombs? <laughs> See what he's got. He <laughs> better melt bombs. Oh, for now, has the octo laser. <laughs> <laughs> consolidate into combat so that I can't octo oh, you. Octo, <laughs> octo oh, laser. Yeah. Oct oct Octomus Prime over here can't <laughs> shoot you to death. <laughs> Um, so I'm stuck in melee now, and it's turn five. Red has just liquefied me. Yeah, okay, yeah, I'll Octo shoot them. Fun, Octo laser. <laughs> I've got a laser for each of you. Well, then that's what Tanky's gonna do. He's gonna go whoop, and then pivot around and be like ready to Octo laser. Stay in melee, because he's got to. Uh, and then we're gonna shoot. So let's shoot some guns. Uh, eight Laz cannons into the squad that can't make up its mind whether it has to be alive or dead. <laughs> it's Schrodinger's cat over there. Yeah. It's Schrodinger, yeah, Schrodinger's yeah. Marines. <laughs> that's, that's enough hits. Of course, I'm not going to make any of these. Uh, no, I kill them all. Okay. <laughs> you want to shroud? Shroud it. Shroud it. Shroud it. Shroud it. Do it. And that's oh, wait. I have to do my heavy boulders as well, actually. Oh, okay. to, to, and then you shroud. Oh, sorry. One more save. Or hit. And then three rolls to wound. Three rolls to wound. Nah, nothing. <laughs> Didn't matter. Make one five plus and ruin my day. Do it, do it, do it, Jay. Do it. One five plus. Do it one at a time, you dick. Uh, <laughs> you're not going to get any of it. Oh! First oh, fight, look at you. Look at you. Why did you <laughs> sound such yeah, hubris? You rolled four at the same time. Like, like Yahtzee? Oh, no, he still failed. All all he's all out of fours out. now. He spends all his fours early in the game. Well, we're in a combat. Your initiative five. Murderers strike me to death. Now, my automatic shielding means that I get D3 damage instead of um, just dying from your Paragon Blades. Do it. Uh, so we hit you on threes because we're still six. six. Yeah. Uh, all? And I need sixes. Sweet. Uh, isn't it murderous five plus? It is murderous five. Yeah, but yeah. you got no wounds yeah. anyway. So if you wound, it's murderous automatically because okay, yeah. you wound me on yeah. fives. 
Threes. Well, can, and then, do it. can Jay do it? No. no. Oh, 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 I guess you're not paragony enough. Well, no Mr. Part. Lightning Claw can go. Oh, sure. <laughs> And t tickle me. Oh, down. you're top seven. Yeah, right. And you reroll Thunder Rolls. Too, right? Yeah. So five fives? Yeah, one. Three attacks. Oh, I get one more dice. Yeah. Okay. And then they. And Sorry. then does that one wound? No. Rerolling? Oh, uh, yes. Reroll. No. One so wound. One wound. Uh, uh, automatic shielding. Five plus. Yeah. I'm good. Well, you didn't kill me, so I'm gonna give everybody one hug. I'm gonna hug each Praetor once. <laughs> I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna stick the landing on all of these. I'm gonna oh, hug the hug the Terminators once. So hug the Terminators on a three. Oh no. And then I wound them on a two. <laughs> All right, four plus, or you get space squashed. Nope. He's okay. All right, Praetor the first, big axe man. I hit him on fives. Let's That's right, go. fives. No. Oh, thank oh. God. Praetor, <laughs> Praetor the second on fives. Oh, oh on twos. Just one. Hippity hey, hoppity, no. get off my hey, property. Hey, four hey, plus. Hey, 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 yeah, screw it. Four plus. Hey, hey, <laughs> four plus. Hey, oh, oh no. fine. All right, give him the fist. Did the mandate. Hey, four chain fists and two. I went and like two power fists. Both hit, Ooh. and then threes to wounds. Yeah. Two wounds, two AP. Oh, yeah, five. Five plus an automatic shielding. Pick them both, oh, boxcars. Oh, Don't mess with Talon. Oh, Talon's where it's oh, at. Romantic. Five. One hit five. with a chain fist, and it rerolls all failed rolls to wounds because of armor bane. Yes. No. So one save, five plus. I'm good again. Oh, the shield. Trip sixes. Ah, uh, the karmic balance is back in my favor against Jay. <laughs> five. Uh, so it's bottom of five, you guys. Uh, yep. It's just combat unless you want to fall back. But you uh, actually, sorry, you can't because you have to have um, uh, the inability to wound me in order to do our weapons. Yeah, we're, we're ready to fight, though. We are, we are we're ready good. to fight. Okay. All right, so initiative five. Let's give the big old axe a try again. Threes. All oh. this. Pretty good. Just needs a five. If it wounds, wound it's instant death. One. One. Okay, so my automatic shield on a five plus. D3. Nope. D3 three. wounds. Three. Three. Ugh. Two wounds They're remaining. Hard you, to kill. you stabbed him right in the in the hydraulics. Ooh, all hit. All hit. Oh, D5. can the Praetors do it? One. One. Ooh, five plus. Ah, against Jay, I always oh, say. Oh, baby. And that's your lightning claws. Lightning. They might kill me. It's on three fives. Attacks. Yeah, three attacks because you hit. get special weapons. Six and then the five's you're rolling the wound, isn't it? Six is because you're swapping seven. seven. But it didn't work. All right, once again, we're going to do the oh, man dance with everybody. No. Tra <laughs> Traitors get one, <laughs> Terminators get one. Terminators? I missed. Okay. Uh, Praetor the first. This is uh, Christmas oh, Praetor on a four, five. Nope. And then oh, against the other one on a five. Can hit Jay's for sure. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Two plus. Make that save. Make it, Jay. Hey, look. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. Destroyed, oh, deleted. That is three combat res. Three combat res so finish, off, finish me off, or you're gonna have to make a test. Chain fists. Oh, chain fists. Uh, on fives. Uh, I got the harvest. Harvest. Yep. Fives. Ooh, Double hits. Oh, they're getting mad. They're kneecapping. This guy's lucky. They're kneecapping. One. One save. Five boss onto magic shield. No. Nope. There's, There's a wound. Down to one. Last wound. Come on, chain fists. On fives. Get him. Get a hit. Get a hit. Two hits. Ooh. Threes to wound. Be rolling. Ooh, okay. Oh, no. I Can I just hey, boxcar oh. it? Boxcars! Nice <laughs> job. <laughs> he bought enough time to line up the Octo laser. <laughs> <laughs> so no combat res because you won. Uh, and it's turn six, top oh, of. We do get to move. Ending a move. Because oh. I'm going to back up outside as well. Uh, we, uh, <laughs> uh, that's right, you can move your initiative and consolidate. Oh, then we're bulky. And your heavy is your minus one, that's right. So you move three and then he can move five. And then you can. And you're not allowed to join the squad because they don't yeah, like they how don't you like smell. Yeah. That's right. I don't know if I can get outside of 12, but I'm going to try and back up to desperately. Mm -hmm. I think he can probably move. Well, if I move him. Yeah. Well, I don't get a cover save anyways because uh, my invuln's better. So yeah. might as well just five towards him. Just not to blow him. Yeah. Sweet. <laughs> well, yeah. I'm shooting the Germans because I'm way more scared of them. Yeah, so <laughs> my last shooting phase, Octo. This thing has been underwhelming the whole game. <laughs> Let's see if we can finally finish off this Terminator squad. Hitting oh, on threes and the Terminators, yeah. Oh, good. Uh, oh, half! Good. Again, <laughs> two thirds of the time I hit half the time. Oh, means half. Ah, just, yeah. <laughs> four saves, four plus invul. Routing? <laughs> Invul's first, After, fours. Yeah. One more, one more, one more. Oh, four of them. Oh, yeah. Oh. Okay. And then two, do you want shroud? Yes. Yeah, you should shroud. Yeah, it's instant death. You gotta make four, four, four shroud saves, yeah. Four this is an after three. save. Fives. Mm, oh, one one dead and one's got a wound. Maybe. Uh, twin linked. And then on threes it wounds. Uh, it's going to be two more saves. I'll take off uh, you got a morale check. Oh, yeah. On to them. I think they're Lucia Bay. They're laughing. They don't care. 
Uh, and that's it. That's the, that's the turn. So you guys get to come and try and blow me up. Last turn. Last turn of the game. It's all points. No big deal. It's no, fine. No You're big fine. deal. You're good. I have to make the charge. Everything has to work. <laughs> I'm going to spend my movement thing to withdraw. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you like deuces. Yeah, yeah. It's like game. This just backs up around yeah. the corner and says, no thank you. Yeah, yeah. Um, and now we can't combat. So we both chose infantry as our blood feud. So you're going to get one, two, uh, it looks like three points for my infantry. Uh, and then you got my warlord for four. And then last man standing for five because you have more units. You got, uh, one, two infantry squads, three infantry squads destroyed, four for the Praetor, and then five for Slay the Warlord. And so it looks like it's a draw. Game five to five. Um, we managed to pull off a draw, and both of us took horrific casualties, but the Praetor <laughs> sealed the deal in the end and uh, showed that if you got the points, always take a Paragon Blade. Also, the Cataphracti is ending up being tougher than almost anything else in the game, as they shrugged absolutely everything that came at them. I thought that the um, Spartan might be a bit overwhelming in a small thousand point game, but it just couldn't seal the deal against any of this infantry, and Shrouded was a big deal. Uh, keeping stuff alive on the way in. As we're playing through just the starter set contents, I did want a chance to show off what Jay and Chris have been painting. J uh, Jay and Chris have basically done a thousand point armies based on the rules we had. So beautiful converted Praetor, um, along with all these cool Mark III Death Guard, some lovely Terminators, Death Tr not Death Shroud Terminators, but like just um, Cataphract Terminators, and some Tartarus ones. I think the cooler miniatures for my Raven Guard, definitely. And unfortunately, no carries pattern assault cannon. So we're probably just going to use it as Gravis heavy bolters uh, in the rules. But the uh, assault cannon doesn't appear to exist in the, um, the the core rules as we have them right now. And we got some more Tartarus pattern, or sorry, um, uh, Cataphractic pattern terminus for the Iron Warriors. Some of the Iron Warriors Legionnaires. The Praetor can turn into a Fafnir. And then the Dread Team. So lots of games to come. I look forward to seeing these guys on the table more in the future. I'm going to paint up a second Loyalist uh, army as well, probably, to face these guys down and have someone who's at the Siege of Terra. Um, and we'll get to some, some narrative gameplay for these guys coming up soon. So there we go, our first playthrough of Warhammer the Horus Heresy, Age of Darkness. Um, trying to basically pit starter set against starter set and showing off both the allied rules, for having an allied detachment in your core detachment, as well as the Raven Guards units that are available in the box set. So big thanks for watching. Um, we're going to keep playing and shaking out these new rules. Obviously, one of the, I, I did notice one thing I think we got wrong at the end of all of it, which was just a holdover from many editions of Warhammer that we thought was true. And that's going to happen, I think, a lot in this because it's based on a classic rule set where there's so many like variations of that rule set. Um, we thought Blast Template's partial hits only happen on a 4+, plus. it's a Warhammer slash like 3rd edition 40k thing. No, if you touch something with a template, it's hit. So I think we robbed ourselves a couple Havoc Launcher hits there overall, but mostly it was um, it was exactly like uh, uh, you know a 3rd edition Blast Template rules, Maestro Blast Skill and stuff like that. Actually, that's a 7th edition thing. Anyway, it, lots of editions basically blended together in this one, and we're really enjoying it. It was it was familiar yet different with the reaction system um, and all of, like the core principles, like plasma principles changing, having rending as opposed to always being AP two. There was a little less all or nothing in some of the rules, which I found really refreshing and, and interesting. So, big thanks for watching. We'll see you next time for more Horus Heresy. Till then, Mash. Don't forget me. Hey there. I hope you enjoyed that video. There are tons of other games already recorded for you to watch. Click over to my channel page if you haven't already, and have a look to the dozens of playlists full of videos. I guarantee you'll discover a game you haven't seen played before. I put out new videos seven days a week, and every day is themed to a different genre as I continue to explore the wider world of gaming. Of course, none of that's possible without you, the viewer, so click a like and subscribe if you'd like to stay on top of what's happening here daily. My two kids and I are massively grateful to be able to have the flexibility of this job so I can always maximize my time with them. If you want to support me continuing to put out this content, it's only possible because of my amazing backers on Patreon who support the studio, equipment, and model cost, as well as being how I make the bulk of my living. You can also help out by buying a t-shirt through Spreadshirt, a measuring gauge or widget from Death Ray Designs, or buying one of my games and supplements like Last Days, Gamma Wolves, and Blaster. As a way of showing my appreciation, patrons get early access to new games and supplements that I write throughout the course of the year. Huge thanks for watching, it really does help out, and happy gaming.